Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. So in today's video, we're gonna be showing you guys how to bypass the minimum system requirements for installing Windows 11, specifically the new 22H2 update. Now we already have a video similar to this in which we follow along with Microsoft's official bypass method, but we wanted to cover this new method for those of you who want to run this new 22H2 update. Now, before we get into today's video, if you're interested in your own copy of Windows 10, Windows 11, or other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll have links down in the description box below. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so if you haven't downloaded Windows 11 already, we're gonna start by doing that. So we're gonna pull up Microsoft Edge. And then we're going to go to the website aka.ms slash download Windows 11. Now, in this video, we're doing this for demonstration purposes only. My computer fully supports all versions of Windows 11, but this bypass method will work if you're on a computer that doesn't have the CPU or TPM requirements. So once we're at this page, we're going to scroll down and we want to download the disk image ISO. So we'll select the Windows 11 from the dropdown, press download. Here we select our language and we'll press confirm. And then we need to hit this 64 bit download button right here to start the download. Okay, so once we've started the image file download, we're now gonna go ahead and download the bypass. Now we're using a bypass download that was created by Tips2Fix and we'll leave the download link for that in the description box below. All right, so I've got the download here on my desktop. I'm just gonna double click to unmount the RAR. And what I got in there was a Windows 11 22H2 bypass.cmd. So this is a command. Now, if it downloads as a .txt, it's not gonna work by simply double clicking it. Now, to make sure that you have a .cmd and not a .txt, we need to unhide the file extensions. All right, so I pulled up my file explorer. We're gonna change the options for the desktop folder. So we'll click these little three dots right here and we'll press on options. If you're on Windows 10, it'll just say options in this area right here. And we'll click over to the view tab. You see where it says hide extensions for known file types. Just uncheck that and press OK. So we can see we've got the .cmd and we'll just double click this. Press yes on this pop up. Now once you've run the bypass, you should be all good to go ahead and upgrade to Windows 11. Now we're not actually going to cover the Windows 11 installation in this video. If you want to see that, we have several videos covering that and you can click on one right here. All right, so that's gonna do it for today's video. If you guys have any questions, drop them in the comment section below and we'll help you out as soon as we can. Again, if you're interested in your own copy of Windows 10, Windows 11, or other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll have those links in the description box below. So thanks for watching and we'll see you guys in the next video.